Hi friends, today is Friday, July 21st. I'm Mike Malcolm, and here's what's coming up at the Church of St. Mary. Summer is drawing to an end, and with fall means a lot of activity is going to ramp up here at the parish and at the school. Father Stewart took the staff on a retreat this week to Stillwater. The staff saw Father Brian O'Brien give a presentation on evangelization, and we did that at the brand new Our Lady of Grace Retreat Center in Stillwater. It's excellent, by the way. And then we visited St. John Catholic Student Center and St. Francis Xavier. So we saw all of the Catholic monuments in Stillwater, and it was great. Thank you for the hospitality. Stillwater, it was good. I want to introduce to you three new members of the staff, and we've talked about them before, but I want to make sure that you have a face to put with the name. So one of our uh, most recent hires is Katie Swikoski. She is going to take over some of the First Communion, First Reconciliation, preparation, some parish life things, some hospitality things. That is Katie. She's great, and I hope that you get to meet her sometime soon. Same goes for Emily Camp. She is going to be our adult faith formation leader, and that really means that she's going to take over Emmaus or RCIA, that process of becoming Catholic. And then Kelly Steichen is going to be working on a master's degree, but at the same time, she's going to help us with evangelization. So it's wonderful to have these three great new people on staff. Now, the school has a, a position open. They are looking for a Spanish teacher, and so that would be somebody else who I'd love to introduce to you. If you know a great Spanish teacher, send that person to churchofstmary.com slash jobs, and all the info is right there. Same goes for the church. We're looking for a parish secretary. We're looking for somebody who is highly organized, but highly friendly and welcoming. That is listed in a great job description in this week's bulletin and on the church website, churchofstmary.com slash jobs. The preschool continues to search for a playground coordinator and a before school care teacher. Construction continues in this late summertime. The School is getting a, a major overhaul of the first and second grade classrooms as well as the middle school science classroom. In the first and second grade classroom corridor, we're running in new plumbing lines down the hallway, and that is coming, that process has been long, but it's coming to a conclusion. The teachers in first and second grade are going to get an expanded section of storage in their classroom, something that every teacher would appreciate. Out in the vestibule, workers installed a so-called slat wall that will allow the parish to turn that kind of unused corner of the vestibule and make it into a space where if you want to buy a t-shirt, you can support the school. If you want to register your kids for Catechesis of the Good Shepherd or for confirmation class, or if you want to sign up for that retreat next month, you can all do it right there. And some of the new super greeters, as I call them, our hospitality experts, will be trained and they'll be able to help you through it all. Um, outreach continues. The outreach construction over across the street continues, but we don't get to see a lot when we're just driving by. But let me assure you that inside there's a flurry of activity. They are finishing up a lot of the detail work, um, the trim and everything. They've got a lot of the security cams and the IT systems are coming to a conclusion. They're getting everything installed. It's been great. It's been busy, but it's been great. Supper Club is a great parish ministry that is purely social maybe a little culinary too. Sometimes it's a fancy dinner with candles lit and the nice china to eat upon. Other times it's a hamburger that's been barbecued and you eat it on a paper plate with some chips out on the patio. If you want to sign up for it, go to the vestibule and look for the silver balloon, or you can go to churchofstmary.com slash supper and sign up right now. The last thing that I have to bring to you is a special presentation from our Encore Ministry, and it is a uh, look at healthcare, uh, and specifically looking at the difference between home health care, between hospice, and palliative care. If you come to this presentation on July 28th, it's a Friday afternoon at 1 o'clock, then you can learn all the details and ask some experts in the field about uh, those topics. So, good stuff going on here. It's busy, and I am looking forward to seeing you this weekend. Take care.